guys, my name is Lily. Welcome back to my channel or to my channel if you're new. So I'm doing another college vlog for you guys. It is a Monday, March 9th. Yeah, March 9th. Yesterday was my mom's birthday. We, I was home for the whole weekend. My brother came home. It was super fun. But it is back to school. I have three weeks left until spring break. My spring break is later than a lot of other colleges. Like a lot of my friends are on their spring break this week and next week. But we still have three weeks. Which I'm honestly excited about just because it'll be warmer. Our break starts March 28th. So it'll go into April and I'm going to the beach. So I'm excited because it'll be a lot warmer than it would be if we went now. But it is kind of hard seeing all your friends on break and you still have three weeks of school. I'm going to make it through. I have my biology lab in a little bit I think like I have to need I need to leave in like 25 minutes and normally after that I have human communications but my professor actually is sick and she canceled class this morning she thinks that she's sick but it's good because it'll give me time to get some work done some homework done work on my bible study before I head to work today also have work and then the bachelor is tonight it is the finale episode but it's like Monday and tomorrow so I'm not exactly sure like how it's gonna end but it's a two night special but this is like the last part of it so if you guys are watching let me know what you think in the comments below about whatever happens i don't know what's gonna be but by the time this video is up you guys will all know what happened if you watch so i just finished eating breakfast a bagel and yogurt so good and i'm going to get ready now for the day and then head on out it's supposed to be so nice today and a lot warmer this week than it has been so i'm really excited for that Alright, we were dressed for comfort as usual. I'm sure you guys are not surprised. 8.43, I need to leave right now. So, gonna get my bag. Oh, I have my little bar in here for a snack later if I get hungry for work. This is honestly, I think, my favorite flavor of RX bar. So, yeah, I'm just gonna pack up my bag. It's gonna be a great day, guys. I'm feeling it, feeling the good day vibes. I'm excited that class got canceled, or my second class at least got canceled. That'll give me more time to get things done because I'm gonna have a fun night. So I'm gonna go ahead, fill up my water, and head out because, like I said, I need to leave right now. and I'm finally leaving oh my gosh it literally took so long it was just a lot of waiting and the thing like some of the things that we were doing wasn't like working not on it wasn't like our fault it was just I don't even know what was happening but it took so long I'm leaving now second class got canceled so I'm gonna go to Starbucks get a coffee because I was literally falling asleep like I don't think you guys understand <laughs> my eyes were literally closing because at one point we were just um sitting there like waiting for the thing to get done we were like sitting there waiting for the thing that wasn't working to get fixed i don't even know like what we were doing we we're doing something with like photosynthesis and um i literally like my eyes were closing but the good thing is it feels so good out it's 60 degrees the sun is out so i'm really glad about that it's making me feel a little more energized so i am going to get a cold brew because i need the extra caffeine and i'm going to work on my bible study and i have to fill in um, some notes for my biology lecture that I didn't get to finish during the lecture because I was doing like other stuff in the class 
So I want to finish those so I can have them done before class tomorrow. And I think I have an online assignment due tonight too. I'm obviously not going to finish it all before I have to go to work. Especially since my lab took the whole time. But I'm going to get some of it done so I don't have as much to do when I get home from work. Because I'm always super tired. I'm leaving Starbucks right now. I'm walking back to my place. I'm like having trouble breathing. Um, I'm going to pick up my lunch and refill my water and just that kind of stuff. And then head to work a little bit early so I can just chill with my mom for a little bit. Since it's so nice out, I'm excited because we'll probably be outside like all day, which is going to be fun. But yeah, I didn't get a lot of homework done. I spent most of the time doing my Bible study. And then I just kind of like wanted to go through my planner and write out my to-do list and just like look at my week ahead and like things that are coming up. Literally, I have a test Thursday in art, which is like a class I'm taking online and we barely have to do anything for it, which is nice. But then I like forget about the class sometimes. And so I didn't even know that I had a test on Thursday and it like unlocks Thursday morning and then you have to finish it by midnight. So I'm glad that I figured that out so I don't miss that test. Um, so yeah, I just was kind of like planning out my week and stuff and figuring out what I have to get done when things are due, what I need to be, what I need to be preparing for. And yeah, now I feel a lot more organized and like I know what's happening, which is good to start the week off like that. That's kind of how I like to spend my Mondays. My hair is literally all on my face. <sighs> Hello guys, I'm back from work. It was such a good day. We were outside literally for so long just because it's been raining so much here recently. As you guys have seen in my vlogs, I feel like I'm always talking about how it's raining and I have to walk throughout campus in the rain. So we just wanted to like let the kids be out there as long as possible because obviously when it rains or even if it has rained, we aren't allowed to go outside because it's like super muddy. And of course, like I'm with kindergartners if you guys didn't know. So they literally just like get muddy so easily. So we were out for so long, which was so nice. But I'm back at my place now. It's almost six o'clock and I think I'm just going to make something really easy for dinner. Just like honestly eggs and like cut up some fruit and probably some rice cakes. Just simple because you guys know I'm... I'm all about the easy stuff and just keeping it healthy but really super simple and i just like i don't know about you guys but i literally just eat the same things like all the time i feel like before going to school i was more like i ate more things because i just had more time and accessibility to like cook more like just different variety of things but now since being in college and literally just having like hardly anything to cook with all i have is that skillet i just like make the same things over and over again and i honestly am not sick of them like it's all still good to me and as long as it's healthy and makes me feel good that's all that i care about so i make a lot of the same things so sorry if you guys see me make literally the same thing every time but it's all my favorite stuff and it's cheap stuff to get so <laughs> it's what you gotta do when you're in college but i'm sure over the summer i'll like start cooking some more things that i like used to make and stuff so and then i need to um finish writing my biology notes because i didn't get hardly very far at all and i don't think i don't think we finished all of chapter 13 i think we stopped halfway through or something so i might not fill in the whole thing but i kind of want to so i can start on the online homework because i have chapter 13 14 and 15 due sunday night online like the homework that we have to do 
but I know that we're not gonna get all the way through 15 like we're not gonna get through those notes by the end of this week so I don't know why I would have to do that much but whatever I'm just going on and on about it but yeah probably gonna try and finish that up and I think that's all that I have to do and then I'm gonna head over to my friend's house a little before 8 because she got a kitty and I'm so excited I can't wait to cuddle with the kitty during the show but I just want to get there before 8 o'clock which is when the bachelor comes on just so I can play with the kitty for a little bit and then we're gonna watch the bachelor I'm so excited to see what happens <laughs> So I just put some peanut butter and jelly on rice cakes, the usual eggs with spinach and um, red pepper. And I finished off my everything but the bagel seasoning, so I just dumped it all on there. And then a bowl of fruit with cinnamon. I'm so excited to eat this. Alright, so I haven't gotten very far on my notes. I just started chapter 13. I did like this much earlier today. <clears throat> and I just started doing this because I was editing um, a vlog. I have like kind of a method to... Um, taking notes, I guess you could say my method is just color. If I just look at notes that are just in pencil, or in, in maybe look a little bit of highlighting, it's just not enough for me to be able to like look at and study when I go back. So, first of all, I do take notes like handwritten, obviously, as you guys can tell. Oh, this is like zoomed in. I do handwrite my notes because I just feel like writing it out helps me remember it better than typing. I know that I could type and all of the lectures are online. Obviously, I'm copying them down. But just looking at a computer screen is not good enough for me. I'm a very like visual and like hands-on kind of person. So I just need to write them out. So it does take a lot of time, but I think that that is like part of studying. So like I said, I just like to do color coding. I usually like will do the title in one color and then the like what's under it um, in a different color. And I just like to do fun colors so that it just is pretty. And then I highlight like if there's like some key vocab words. So as you can tell, our homework online, it's like through, it's by chapter. So like chapter 12 lines up with the chapter 12 lecture notes. And as I'm like going through the homework and doing it, I write down like just some key things. And I'm, I know that I'm definitely like rewriting some things, but I feel like if it's on the homework, that means that it like stands out because obviously there's so much material in the lectures. So I just feel like writing down some of the key things from the homework is a good idea because then it helps me know like, okay, this is probably important. Use these pens. I've literally been using these pens for so long. If you guys have like any other pen recommendations, because you guys probably know these pens, like the paper made um like flare but if you have any other good pen recommendations let me know because these ones are kind of drying out and i literally get a new pair of these like once a year and they, they'll last me like a whole school year but by the end of the school year i usually just like throw them away or like stop using them because they kind of dry out but they definitely do the job so that's how i take my notes it is 7 24 i'm probably gonna leave here in like 10 minutes because i have to walk to the parking garage oh can you focus i have to walk to the parking garage obviously and i want to get there before eight so just gonna finish this up and i'm definitely not gonna finish chapter 13 i don't know why i said finish up but kind of get to a stopping point and get ready to into a comfier outfit so my sweatpants are or like my joggers are from old navy and this sweatshirt guys we went to the outlets yesterday for my mom's birthday just to like do something fun tommy hilfiger sweatshirt or like cropped hoodie for 24 dollars. it was 70 or no yeah 70 percent off normally 80 dollars, and i got it for 24 so that was such a steal i feel so cool now but i'm gonna head out and go watch the bachelor mm -hmm. 